Hi, my dear friends. Uh, thank you so much for your positive feedback about my previous video on how to manifest your dream life. With simple practice that will not take more than five minutes of your time, you will transform your life in a very short period of time. And today I want to talk more about how this is happening, how the reality is transforming, how we're manifesting. And as an example, I want to take love. Love is the highest frequency. Love is the highest vibration. And when I take love as an example, uh, I will show you how this works. You will feel it yourself. So let's do it together. Very simple. We often send love to our family, our children, our friends. Yes, we say, I'm sending love, I'm sending positive vibrations and so on. And now let's do it together. Uh, imagine your family member or friend or a group of people and let's send them love right now together. Okay, ready? Close your eyes and just imagine this person or persons and just send love right from your heart to these people. Love, care, yes. And on my face, I, I know to smile and probably you're smiling too, because we feel it ourselves. We send love and the love came to us. It's like the love was born inside of us while we were sending it to people. You see, it's very profound. When you send in love, the love was born inside. And as love itself is the highest angelic vibration, it doesn't have time, so it happened simultaneously. With no time, with no limits, it just came back to us. With this being said, what we send to others is coming back to us. More and more we send, we give to people, it's returning to us. Why? Because we are giving to ourselves. Because on a high level, we are all one. We are all connected. When we send love, it returns back to us immediately, immediately. What happens when we send something not on a high frequency, on a low frequency? Yes, it will get back to us. Not simultaneously, because it's not that high frequency, but eventually it will. It may be transformed somehow, but it will be back to us. It will affect us. So basically we are giving to ourselves through others. You see? And we feel the same. We feel the same when we give love, care, gifts. We feel the same. That's why it's so nice to send gifts, to give presents. Because we feel this joy once we did it. We feel it. We feel like we gave it to ourselves. And that's why we want to share. We want to share with our family members, with our partners, with our kids. We don't want to go on vacation alone. We want to take somebody with you to share this joy, to share these emotions, this experience with others. Because through others, we're giving to ourselves. You cannot feel yourself. You can feel yourself by feeling others. Through feeling others, you're feeling yourself. And whatever you want to feel yourself with, feel others first. And then it will get back to you. That's how simple it is and we felt it we felt it when we closed our eyes and sent love we instantly felt it to ourselves the love returned to ourselves why because i am you and you are me and we are all one we are all connected thank you namaste